Hello everyone, welcome to BAMIDM and ABDM workflow demo videos. In this video, we will see how the APA address, or previously known as the head ID, can be captured using the registration module in BAMINI. Uh, we would also look at how BAMINI is used as an HIP service to create and share digital records through the PHR app. And lastly, we would look at how BAMINI functions as an HIO, that is health information user, to view the medical records of a patient who might have visited some other facility or a BAMINI integrated hospital as well. In this video, we will look at how the demographic details of a patient can be captured uh, using the ABHA ID in Bamini. Uh, I have logged into Bamini and I am going inside the registration module. I will click on create new record. Now the receptionist does not have to manually fill up the demographic details of the patient. We can simply click on verify ABHA. This will open a pop-up box. Uh, now there are multiple ways to verify the ABHA ID. One is by manually entering the ABHA number or the ABHA address over here. The other way uh, is by scanning the patient's QR code which can be found on the health ID card. Let us try the second method for now. Once I click on patient QR code, uh, this will open the webcam and I can scan the QR code uh, from my mobile device or the health ID card. As you can see, the ABDM record of this patient has been found and there are no similar records uh, that are found in Bamini for this patient. So we can safely assume that this is a new patient and uh, we'll click on create new record. In case uh, this was an existing patient, uh, the, Bamini, the existing Bamini records would have been found over here as well. I'll click on create new record. Once I do that, you can see that the patient's uh, demographic details have been fetched over here. The name, gender, age, uh, as well as the uh, ABHA number and the ABHA address along with the primary contact number. In this video, we will look at how Bamini functions as a HIP to create and share digital records via the PHR app. I'll log into the clinical module in Bamini. I've started a visit for this patient over here. Now I'm inside the patient's dashboard. Uh, I'll click on consultation over here. Uh, I'll go ahead and add some medication for the patient. And I'll save uh, the new prescription. Now I'll go ahead and close the visit for this patient. Click on close visit. Once the visit is closed, uh, the patient can go to the PHR app over here, click on providers and try to uh, type in the name of the facility where the patient had been treated. And I'll click on fetch records. As you can see, uh, I had started a special OPD visit for this patient and this is being discovered at the moment. I'll click on link selected. Uh, this takes a while to be reflected on the PHR app. Let me log in again. As you can see, I'm getting this message that I have successfully linked the records. Uh, this takes a while to be reflected over here, uh, but after uh, it is reflected, yes, uh, this is being reflected right now, 5th of February, the, I have added a prescription and I can see uh, that the medicine that I had added is being reflected over here. In this video, we'll see how Bamini can be used as an HIU to view patients' medical records. We have logged into Bamini and we'll be logging into the ABDM HIU module over here. Once I'm inside the HIU, I'll click on New Consent Request. 
I'll type in the uh, Abhay address of the patient. I can choose the date range for the medical records. I can also choose the health information type that I want to view of the patient. And also the consent expiry date over here. I'll go ahead and raise the consent from the HIO over here. As you can see, uh, I have raised the consent for this patient, Umer. Now on the patient's uh, PHR app over here, let me log in again. If I click on request, I can see that the consent has been raised. I can now grant or deny the consent from here. Uh, let me go ahead and grant this consent. Once the patient has granted the consent, I'll come back to the HIO. Once I click on refresh, I can see that the consent has been granted for this patient. And now the medical uh, record for this patient is available over here.